The Minister of Justice and Attorney General of the Federation, Abu Bakr Malami, has declared as baseless the alleged illegal sale of 48 million barrels of crude oil export in 2015 to China, currently being probed by House Other Committee. The Attorney General and Minister of Justice made this disclosure in Abuja while appearing before the House uh, Committee investigating the alleged loss of over $2.4 billion in revenue, including crude oil exports from 2014 to date. The allegation is unpounded, is lacking in merit, and indeed lacking in substance. It is, in its own right, the allegation devoid of any reasonable ground pointing to a material suspicion and cogent enough to invoke the constitutional oversight of the committee. Why do I say so? Mr. Chairman, sometimes in 2016, allegations were arrived and hived in the social media. There were allegations of existence of stolen 48 million barrels of Nigerian crude oil in China, said to have been valued at 2.4 billion. The president, President Mamadou Pari, informally requested the attorney general, making reference to my humble person, Mele Kiari, former DGSS, Lawal Daura, and late Abba Kiari, to look into it and advise but unfortunately, Mr. Chairman, for there to be a reasonable ground for suspicion, at least you require certain basic facts. The committee was, however, concerned on why stolen funds recovered were deposited in an asset recovery account instead of the Federation account as stipulated by law. Recall that the House other committee had written severally to the minister three times, requesting his appearance at the investigative hearing before his final compliance. You repeated severally that all the recoveries, even the ones you made by yourself, were deposited to asset recovery accounts. Because we are assuming on this part, before we conclude, we still want a guide from you, that part of what is causing the misinformation is because we, maybe the process or the procedure, we have been contravening them. If you have, for example, a revenue being maintained, dedicated to asset recovery for the purpose of transparency and accountability of it, at the end of the day, the money that goes into the asset recovery account find its way to which account? To the account being referred to under section 162, which indeed the Federation account. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.